Hi everybody and welcome to the plan with me for May. Isn't it crazy? It's already May. We're already almost halfway through, um, halfway through 2021, which is insane to think about. Um, so before I start, I apologize. I'm uploading this a couple of days late. Um, I do think I have a legitimate excuse though, because I did just finish the last of my my last ever homework assignment for any school ever. I just finished my master's degree. Um, so that being said, I'm really excited to plan for this month um, because I am officially graduated and now officially unemployed, I guess, or should I say seeking employment. So there's a lot that I have to get done um, and a lot that I wanna plan and a lot more free time for me to focus on getting those plans done. So I'm gonna be honest, I have not been keeping up with my Hobonichi um, as of super late uh, because obviously, like I said, I've been really, really busy. Um, <clears throat> so I am going to start maybe by catching up on my habit tracker. Um, yeah, as you can see, uh, today I'm filming it on the second and I am missing out all of this. So I hate doing this because I feel like it's not like completely 100% accurate, um, but I'm gonna think back um, to what I've been doing. So I definitely, well, yesterday, and I did, I did also forget to write this out um, beforehand so that I could, you know, let it dry. What I'm gonna do though, I think is just highlight it and then I'll write it on later afterwards. But just so you know, I do believe I'm gonna keep up with all of these same habits. Um, and I may replace social with job search, which I think I had in brown way back here. So I'm gonna go ahead and start highlighting. And I'm gonna start from today, so. Oh, yesterday. We went out to eat, so that was nice. And I think, well, we didn't really do anything Friday. It was really busy. This, so we've been spending time together. And my, my husband and I, that this means like spending quality time with my husband, um, which we're both really busy with finals. He, he goes to NYU um, and I obviously just finished. So um, we haven't had like a lot of time as of late. I think that looks about right. Um, social wise, I know Tuesday, I definitely did something social uh, Tuesday. Um, and I'm not going to keep social over. So, uh, really I've been kind of antisocial lately too. Reading. I did read today and I did read yesterday. And I did read the day before that. This is a habit that I haven't really had trouble with lately. Um, and I do have a video on that. I'll have a little like card up um, up here. YouTube will pop it up there. Um, where I, I say how I made reading a habit. I also have a blog post for those of you who don't know. Um, I have a blog that I post to about weekly. Um, and it was kind of the home for my assignments for my graduate program, but now I'm kind of shifting it towards um, kind of to accompany this YouTube channel um, about habits, productivity, um, all that. So, oh shoot, I forgot to, I will keep the reading habit up because I have, you know, so, slowed down a little bit. Um, so I would still like to keep track of it. And let me actually add the brown now for the job search. So job search will include anytime I've applied to something, anytime I've um, had an interview, maybe updating my website, um, things like that. Uh, next is healthy eating. Now, unfortunately, <laughs> I have not been eating healthy in the last few days because I've kind of just been focusing on um, finishing up and then after I did finish celebrating. So I'd probably say, I think Monday I did fine. And then I'd say probably I have not been eating healthy like this whole week. So I'll just be honest with myself and not fill that out. Um, but pick it right back up because it is about to be, you know, beach body season. And I'm hopefully going to the gym again soon. So I'd like to, you know, keep keep up both 
healthy eating and working out when I finally start that again. So yoga and meditation, as you can see, that was one that I really wanted to start focusing on, but I just did not get around to it. And I'm not like beating myself up too much about it, but it is definitely something that I want to start to do. And I think what I'm gonna do is, like I'll, I'm, I'm gonna try my best to get back into yoga, but also on my daily walks with my dog, I might just um, listen to like, I think I have the Mindspace student plan. It's like $10 a year or something like that. Something crazy cheap. So I might start listening to like the mindful walks or even just stopping because they have like a nice flower patch at this park nearby. Um, stopping, sitting down with my dog and just making maybe like 10, 15 minutes to just sit there and meditate in the middle of my walk. Usually I listen to an audiobook when I'm walking, but I think that's an okay. Um, I think that's okay to take out some time. So cleaning, I actually did today. Wait, where am I? I did today. I did yesterday. Um, let me think. Did not do then. I did it then. And I did it then. I, I try to vacuum every other day because um, I'm living in my in-laws house and I have a dog. Um, so And they don't have any animals. I grew up in a house full of animals, so it never really bothered me. But I want to be courteous and just keep my space clean. I'm actually pretty lame because my, my birthday was on April 20th and uh, a gift that I was really excited to get was uh, a vacuum for my parents, <laughs> which I'm really excited about for when I get my own apartment. Let's see, next is Japanese. So again, I have not been keeping up with this at all. Um, I did technically study it today because I tutored it, but like really other than that, and I did last Sunday yeah, as well, but I have not been touching it. Um, it's definitely something that I want to keep up again. So let me add it and just hope hope that it you know starts to work out now that we have um i have more free time and i mean not only hope but actually work towards it like i'm the only one who can make change make positive change so yes uh next we have journaling which i will just keep blank i mean obviously today i'm going to fill it in did I miss something somewhere? Let me see. Oh no, because I, I forgot, I cover up that first one. So journaling, obviously you're gonna fill out today, but really, um, I haven't been using it that much, but fill it out today, starting new, starting fresh. Um, hopefully after I uh, finish this, I will get to the rest of my habits for the day. Um, Next, what do we have? Production. So that is something that I actually do need to fill out because I definitely, Tuesday, I filmed. Thursday, I edited. This marker bleeds a lot. So it's I'm going to need to like let it dry. Uh, it is going to stick over. I might have to grab a tissue. Um, Friday, I edited and filmed. Let's see. Yesterday, I'd say I... I did like a blog post, so I'll count that as a little bit. Um, so that's obviously something that I want to keep up. Oh wait, and then duh, today I'm literally filming a video right now. So I'm going to fill out today completely. Planning on doing some editing for a freelance gig too. So let's see. Oh, on Tuesday I did work on freelance stuff as well. I, I've just been busy. <laughs> Um, which you can see why the rest of the habits haven't really been filled out. I might need to get an orange marker because that thing is really bleeding. Um, all right, and then finally, working out, which is another one that I have not been good at keeping up. Um, okay, but I did, let's see, was it yesterday? No. It was the day before yesterday that I did uh, walk Nika. Um, and I did go on a walk then. Um, and surely I've been on walks like throughout this, but I just haven't kept track. So I'm going to leave it blank. Um, and yeah, yesterday I did nothing. Today, hopefully before I shower, I'll at least do some squats or something. Um, okay, let me add that the washi tape. Let's see. I kind of want to circle back to this nice, like, metallic 
rainbowish. Um, I really like this one. And this is, I'm planning to be like a really good month, so. I mean, really, you should plan every month to be really good, but I mean, this month in particular, I'm, you know, starting a lot of new stuff, organizing everything, so I planning on using my Hobonichi quite a lot. Okay. So, what is that? All right. So I'm gonna go back and like fill this in later and actually let me grab a tissue. You know, dot that just so it doesn't mark on the other, see it marked like here on the other page. And I just haven't really been, um, I've just been a little too lazy to like actually uh, paint over it <laughs> with my paint pen. Um, so, let's see, all right. All right, so that's the habit tracker. Pretty much the same, except I'm switching out with um, the job search. And as you can see near the end of the month, I kind of puck, uh, is it puckered out, tuckered out? I don't know. Um, but I mean, obviously I had my reasons. <laughs> Finishing finals. All right, so let me switch to May. There we go. And so I'm actually already, so this is today. Yesterday, my courses officially ended. Um, I also, I like to fill out things retroactively just to like kind of keep track of when I've been where. Um, it was also my father-in-law's birthday. So we kind of celebrated that. Um, Today I had tutoring, so I'm gonna write that in. Mm -mm. But other than that, I didn't have really any like calendar stuff to do. All right, so let me think. There is a lot that has to get done. So first of all is graduation. So I am graduating. Um, at five o'clock and then also I have to double check the day actually I'm also graduating again next week for my bachelor's degree because last year I never technically graduated so actually let me look this up just so I am 100% sure on the um, I'm 100% sure on the time all right, yeah, it is at one o'clock. So Saturday at one o'clock, I graduate again. And I have to plan out, I, I'm thinking of doing like, just like a bonfire or something this day. Um, and then probably we'll have like a bigger outdoor get together at my, my family's house. We have a lot of outdoor space and I'll actually, I'm gonna have my vaccine by then. Um, so it, we should, it should be fine, but you know, still, still outside. Um, so we can have precautions. Um, and let's see, so that's my graduation stuff. I'm trying to think. Oh, I do have a COVID test on Wednesday. Let me, again, double check. I, I usually fill out things whenever I make an appointment or, you know, I have like a set in stone date. I usually fill out things right away because, um, you know, otherwise I just forget. But yeah, let's see, May 5th at 10.40. I have to get my COVID test before graduation. Test at 10.40 CBS. Um, so I, and actually I believe that is all of like the appointments and stuff that I have. And I'm actually tutoring. Tutor, obviously since I'm graduating then, I am tutoring at like one. Just so, uh, for those of you who are new um, or unaware, I do color code. I, I used to make a key um, on this side, but I haven't since, you know, I, I did that last year, so I'm completely used to what is what. So the yellow is like work or anything I'm getting paid for. The red is personal stuff. So like um, if I have any, um, 
what is it called? Any like appointments or like I'm going to a friend's house or something like that. Um, that's in red. Purple is for projects. So like stuff that I'm, that's unpaid, um, but like I'm working on a documentary or even like YouTube stuff. That'll go in purple if I have any deadlines for that, which I don't believe I have yet. Although I'll probably put my internship stuff in this actually. And then this was for school. I'm, I suppose I should shift this for work stuff. So if I have any interviews or anything, I'm going to start putting it in gray. I do not have anything of that sort yet. So I'm just gonna put that to the side. So I think the last thing, or okay, there's two more things. I do tutor, um, I tutor weekly Tuesdays and I, tu and I have my internship meetings on Monday. So I'm gonna fill that out right now. All right, so I filled all of that out and I am hoping that as I apply to jobs, the rest of this should be filled out. And also, of course, um, I'm gonna be planning, I mean, my, I think most of my friends um, and my husband, they are finishing up their semesters around these weeks. So hopefully this button will be filled up more um, social stuff, um, like beaches, parks, hikes, all that stuff I'm, I'm really excited for. All right, so, um, oh, and oh, and it is my friend's birthday. I do like to write birthdays in here. And we might be doing something for that. So I'll figure that out when it comes along. So that is my month. I might, what did I do last? Okay, I used this black one. I feel like going a little bit lighter, maybe. Maybe this pink and let me see. Well, I gotta do this one a little bit shorter. Well, maybe I'll go along the bottom actually. Um, and I think later on, I'm just gonna add like a little sticker, like a flower or something over here. Actually, do I have them? I think it's in my big case. So I'm gonna bring that out afterwards um, and kind of do them all at once. All right, so that is the month of May for now. Um, and actually I'm thinking about Well, I don't want to smudge my stuff. I, I'm going to do this afterwards, actually. After I let it dry and get my stickers. Um, yeah. Okay, so let's see. All right, so now on to the week. So this was my last week of, um, of April. And I'm going on to May. Let me move my little doggy here. Oh, and I did put my COVID appointment in there. And I maybe put in that graduation, did I put in the other? I did, okay. So, graduation at five, let me actually stencil around it. That is gonna take maybe like two hours and I'll plan something afterwards. All right, so pretty, pretty blank slate. Um, I'm just basically, going to copy over um, what I have from my monthly page. Is it? Copy over what I have from my monthly page onto these. Um, so I'm just gonna fast forward through this. <coughs> uh, excuse me. Um, so I'm just gonna fast forward through this. I like to block out everything on this weekly planner because it shows how much time I'm spending doing what um, and then after I do that, after I do like everything that's set in stone, then I'm gonna kind of like plan out um, on the side here, what I wanna do for each month um, or each week of this month, um, because I am trying to bring like kind of everything together um, because in August I will be moving to New York City. 
So I kind of just want to use this month as a time to prepare <laughs> for that. Um, all right, so yeah, I'm going to, uh, oh, shoot, I forgot. I, we're meeting at six, so I'm gonna have to fix that and then I'm gonna do this, okay. All right, and then um, one last thing is that I do have a D and D Dungeons and Dragons at eight every other Thursday, so I forgot to write that in actually. All right, so I apologize. At some point, um, while I was filling in everything, um, my camera died, so <laughs> you missed a little bit um, from the end of the time lapse, but it's okay. It was pretty boring anyway. I was just time locking everything that I had already written in my monthly planner. Um, and also I forgot I had a D and D. So I added that to my monthly page. Um, so all I have to do now is add my little washi tapes to the bottom of, you know, each week. I just, I like to do that. Cause it, I don't know, it, it leaves some space for, um, you can write like how I'm feeling at the end of every day using like these cute little, um, uh, weather, you know, mood tracker stickers. So I'm going to do that again, time lapse it, and then I'm gonna kind of map out what I wanna do for each week. And I can't believe I actually forgot. Um, May 19th is my my dog's birthday. So I am 100% <laughs> doing the little doggy washi tape. Reminded me. Definitely gonna write that in there. She'll be four. Little doggy washi tape. And I will probably just make that day footy hers because she deserves it. All right, so I have finished my weekly spreads. Um, and now I have to think, I really, <laughs> Um, since I've, I've been so busy this week, um, wrapping up all my schoolwork, I haven't really thought ahead, um, that much what I want to do. So I'm thinking I might start by going to my day page and then coming back to here, um, and mapping out, um, each week. So let me start by going to my day page and see it's, it's so blank because I have not been keeping up with it, which is unfortunate. I did use that because I did have an interview um, and I actually, I got all this done. So I need to update that and um, check those in, finish university, celebrate, did that. Um, all right. So 
Addy Tutor is done today. I'm gonna edit that, also gonna upload my plan with me, which I am filming right now. <laughs> um, I did finish university and I did celebrate at least a little bit. Um, and I did all of this. And I did all of this. So it's satisfying, although probably would have been more satisfying if I did actually filled it out the day of, but oh well, um, it happens. I'm probably gonna use, uh, well, you see, I did use this to like focus on getting my stuff done. Um, probably gonna use this maybe to like sketch out plans, um, something of that sort when I'm maybe like a little bit more relaxed, more calm down uh, because yeah, it's been, it's been a sleepless week <laughs> or not sleepless, but a lot less sleep than healthy. So, um, I'm going to catch up on sleep and then plan that out, but I do at least want to block out this week. So Saturday, um, so this is today. I want to finish, um, a freelance project that I have upload, um, this YouTube video, get that done. Um, and then Monday, Okay, so I do have some plans. So wait, let me actually write that in. So I am going Tuesday. Well, I do have two. Tommy. Tutor. Oh, and then Monday. I have my internship meeting. And also I'm going to do the content calendar. Um, Tuesday I am tutoring and I'm probably, let's think, what, what should I do? I'm going to organize my computers, organize all the files on my computers. Cause just cause they've kind of been a mess from the last few days, but there's also very important stuff, um, that I have to keep track of. So I'm going to organize my files. Um, I'm also going to apply to jobs to maybe I'm going to shoot for like five. Um, and then I'm going to just like clean and organize my living space. Also, you know, on top of this, I want to try and keep up with all my habits. So Wednesday I am giving the COVID test, which means I'm going back to where my parents live. So I'm going to see the goats and stuff. So I'm going to take some goat photos. Maybe a goat yoga video. I don't know if you guys would be interested in that, but uh, my goats just had babies. So I'm gonna try it out at least. <laughs> I can upload it on my Ferns, uh, the Ferns Meadow social page at least. Um, so goat photos, goat yoga video. Oh, and I'm gonna get my, um, I'm gonna get an oil change. I need to schedule that actually today and then clean my car. Like I said, Loose ends all tying that together. Um, Thursday, what am I doing? Well, I know a Friday I'm getting my second vaccine. Yay. And I am tutoring Addie. Thursday, I don't think I have anything planned. Yeah, no, I don't have anything planned. So let me think. I should probably, um, I'm going to do like a, I'll probably do a blog post and also, um, cue more social media posts. I have been, that is not how you spell cue at all, but whatever. I have been kind of like lacking in that lately. So, um, now that I have a lot more free time, I don't have any schoolwork. I definitely want to focus on building this brand. But my goal hopefully is to be monetized by the end of the year. Um, if not by the end uh, of next year. So like in 12 months have 1000 subscribers and 10,000 hours of watch time, which I do think if I do continue to upload weekly, I can reach that. So let's hope um, everyone watching this, if you're watching this point, obviously you're somewhat interested at least. So uh, share it with your friends. Um, I, I would really like to make this, I know it's not gonna be a career, but make it like a stable um, kind of side thing. Cause I'm really passionate about it. I, I really, really like it. Um, and I, I really love like hearing from people um, and hearing that I'm maybe helping people. <laughs> maybe not these videos so much. They might be more therapeutic. I mean, it's a plan with me. Um, but 
yeah, I, that, that's my goal. So I, I want to reach that. Got to work towards it. Um, and then Friday, COVID shot. I am tutoring. I am going to, or this is going to be a big one, actually. Organize and clean um, my house that I kind of moved out of, but I have stuff like in my sister's closet. I have stuff in the basement. I have stuff in the parlor. So I need to get a lot of stuff, um, get it ready to donate. Um, and I don't know the size of my apartment yet, um, but probably even just think about donating the furniture that I know I don't need. Um, and then Saturday, I'm probably just gonna leave blank um, because something might come up so I can plan it then. Um, and also otherwise just relax um, spend time on the weekends to enjoy myself. <laughs> um, but I will actually put upload, upload video. I would like to upload on Saturdays. I do think that's when everyone's most active and you know, you can watch it sometime during the weekend, uh, when people are most free. And then Sunday I graduate. So that is a big one. Um, and I need to plan, you know what? I'm going to put that in for today. So plan graduation get together, not a party, but just like my closest friends. I will invite to maybe like a fire. We can hang out, um, play some games. I love board games. So, <laughs> um, eat at a restaurant, something like that. So I feel pretty good with that. Um, I think. So for this week, this is this week, I'm just focusing on cleaning and organizing. I'm gonna put that in green, kind of like spring cleaning, which I'm probably a little late to the party on that. But, so clean and organize. Oh, and you know what? And I'm gonna put, so home, PC, well, PCs actually. Um, my home in Meriden, my car, and my husband's car, which I actually forgot to add. I uh, will probably, oops, I'll probably go get it washed um, on Wednesday. Or yeah, on Wednesday, I'll, I think I'm gonna get it washed. Or Friday, I mean. So. I would just like to start like, <laughs> once I graduate, just have everything open and free. I, like, I think that would just be so, so nice. Um, to just have everything clean, everything ready, a system ready. Um, all right, so it, it's gonna be a busy week, but I mean, all this stuff I kind of enjoy. I really do like cleaning and organizing. Um, so there's my plan for this week. And next week, I am really just gonna get in gear and just apply to like tons of jobs. Um, and my, I know my friends are still gonna be kind of like busy with, um, busy with finishing up their finals, so. I will kind of leave them be and just keep to myself, apply to jobs. Um, and I think I'm gonna, gonna write all of them that I apply to um, in this column here. Uh, and I might do that, you know, uh, here too, because I do want to apply to some this week as well. Um, I really just want to get myself out there. By the way, also, if you're watching this point and you need to hire someone who is proficient in social media, um, media documentary production, video production, hit me up. <laughs> My portfolio um, is finally up, emmalau.com. Um, of course, I'm going to put it in the description. So, um, or if you know anyone, share it, spread it. Uh, I will be living in the New York City area and I'm, I'm just really excited about like basically starting. Um, it's kind of a new life. I mean, um, it's of course with my husband and my dog, but we haven't lived on our own, um, together yet. And I haven't lived on my own ever. So it's going to be super exciting. And we're moving in with friends who are, um, well, a friend and then, um, some of her classmates, which I'm sure will become friends later. I don't really know them, but, um, she's super nice. Um, and it's just really, really exciting. So <laughs> I'm sure in my next plan with me, there'll probably be a lot more, um, apartment searching stuff, which this week, 
uh, this last week, I'm probably gonna start, well, also applying to jobs. I might leave it blank, actually. Maybe I might get a really good job offer, let's hope. Um, but looking for apartments. Apartments. So planning, viewings, um, showing, and etc. I have my shot, so I'm comfortable going into the city to do that. Um, and let's see, this week, I kind of want to get like my social media strategy, both for myself, so like this MLO, my blog, my YouTube, but also for my family's farm. So, and I do have a plan. I just have to like make a solid, solid implementation because um, I don't know, like the stuff I've found in the past haven't really worked. Um, I, it might include buying another Hobonichi. Um, maybe I'll use a journal for now and buy an Avec um, for my work anyway, whatever job I do end up doing. But I do want to do my social media, so... I'm gonna love YouTube, I will make a solid um, upload schedule. Um, to keep you guys updated, my Facebook, my Instagram, um, and my blog, and then my Ferns Meadow. Facebook is most important. Insta, and probably either like a blog slash YouTube channel. Um, just like vlogs living on the farm. They're not too hard to make. Um, so I just would like to plan that. And then apartment searching is gonna start in May. And then of course, well, this whole time job searching. Um, and then after job searching, a lot of budgeting, which my friend Elena, well, I don't know if her friends, but I did interview her and I really, really, really like her. She's super nice. Um, and she knows a lot about financial planning. Um, and using planners for finance finances. So I'm going to be binge watching a lot of her stuff, probably re-binge watching a lot because I did binge watch even though I haven't really budgeted in the past. Um, so I will be doing that. And then finally we are on to, finally we are on to the day page. So I like to um, take a moment kind of just to reflect on last month's goals. Um, on these like little day pages, I like to write um, some goals that I have and just add like stickers, colors and stuff. I have my box over here that I haven't even brought out yet. Um, so I'm just gonna do that. So let's see, friends, I have not really done a lot with friends. I have done a little bit. It was my birthday, we hung out then. It was my friend's birthday, we hung out, but we've all just been so busy um, that we haven't really, um, I mean, we haven't really had time to hang out. And so I'm not, I'm not like super torn up about it. Although now that things are open, once they start, um, they wrap up their semesters, I'm really, really hoping to use this more, get outdoors more, because it is nice out now. Uh, creative identity, I feel like I definitely, definitely honed in on. Of course, this is something that like never ends, but, um, I feel like putting together my portfolio and like my brand, seeing that all in one place, uh, just really helped kind of uh, me figure out like where, who I am, like what I wanna do, um, seeing what I have done in the past and what I've enjoyed doing in the past um, and just putting that all in one place has helped me really um, get to that creative identity. Inner awareness, um, I feel like I definitely improved um, I didn't really do like yoga and meditation, which is what I thought this meant. However, I do feel like creative identity and inner awareness kind of went hand in hand in a way. Um, again, these are things that evolve and change. Um, and this is definitely something, you know, I definitely have to work on more, but, um, I really, that's something that like I'm going to continue to work on. I don't know if I want to make it a goal for this month, um, but let's actually turn to that page and I'm gonna get rid of this so I don't, oh actually no, it's on the other side, so I can leave it. So for May, I kind of want to do like, let's see, I kind of did like a pink and bluish theme here. I did like a, what did I do for, for April, I did like a kind of pastel-y, um, grassy vibe. I might 
go for more floral stuff again. Let's see. I'm gonna get my big box of stuff out again. Um, I might like actually start by putting these plant things in because I've always wanted to incorporate them, but I never have room because I don't plan to have room for them. smaller because they do take up quite a bit of space. Um, maybe there? I don't know. There we go. We'll cover up the Japanese, I guess. Um, I will take note of that, actually. Okay. I don't know all the kanji. I don't know that kanji, so I'm gonna have to look that up. <laughs> um, I might, I'll pop the translation on the screen before I cover it up. Uh, let's see. Is that good? Maybe there's better. Oh, you know what? Does that look kind of weird? I don't know. I like it. All right. My camera is starting to heat up a little bit, so I'm going to try to finish this as quickly as possible. quickly as possible, I say, and then I struggle to get uh, the sticker off. I'm probably, you know, I kind of want to just make a trip to Michael's. Maybe I'll make like a vlog slash haul out of that because um, I haven't done that in a very long time. And um, I have some like birthday money slash graduation gifts, I'm sure, coming up that I can spend this on. Although, you know, I am moving into an apartment soon. So, uh, might want to save instead would be the better option, but I don't know. I haven't really bought any, like, new Hobonichi stuff other than, like, the Hobonichi itself, obviously, and this cover, um, in a while, so I think it'd be nice to have, like, a new haul. Um, probably donate, like, some stuff that I don't really use, because I am <clears throat> trying to be a little bit more minimal. I mean, that includes in cons consumption, but, like... If I'm not using something, I'll be honest with myself and be like, it would be better in the hands of somebody else. Uh, my friend who is an artist might be able to use it somehow. Um, all right. Yeah, the... the color in the Hobonichi for May is green as well, so I'm not like a huge fan of that green. It's kind of like doo-doo green, I don't know. But uh, kind of making a greenish page. Maybe do like a diagonal. Maybe kind of keep it minimal. No, 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 that is a bad diagonal. That does not please me aesthetically at all. I got this washi tape. I really like the design, but I got it from, I think, like a cheap dropshipping place. Um, so it's like not the best quality, but mm -mm. live and learn. I'm gonna buy only from like quality Etsy um Michaels which I mean Michaels honestly sometimes doesn't have the best quality but you know better than nothing um I kind of feel like I have to border in the rest of this little green tape so I'm gonna do that again disclaimer I mean a little bit of a late disclaimer I am not good at creativity <laughs> um even though I do have an art degree um I am very like scrappy with it. I am nowhere near like a perfectionist, which I mean, sometimes is like 
better for creativity? It depends. But if you want like a very cute, well-designed, well, -designed, well um, pretty handwriting, all that, there's definitely a lot of YouTubers who are really great um, and would serve you better if this is bothering you. Um, it's just me though. I do not blame you if uh, this is this is driving you crazy. Cause I mean, sometimes it drives me crazy, but I don't. It's just who I am. It's always who I've been who I am. I am more worried about the utility and like whether or not it looks, you know, good to me. Okay, there is kind of like a lot going on here. I know I said I wanted it to be kind of minimal, but it ended up being um, quite a bit. But I think about just going black with my goals. So first and foremost is jobs, which I mean, of course I need it. <laughs> I need a job before I move out. Um, I'll honestly really take anything. Um, as long as they offer like at least 50,000, just cause that's how much we'll need to survive <laughs> in New York city. Um, and of course, you know, the more I can accommodate my dog, um, and work life balance, the better, but I am just looking for survival at this point. <laughs> Once my husband graduates, I can worry about, I can be a little bit more picky and choosy later. Um, but you know, aim high, I guess. Um, next is to organize, organize everything. Oh my gosh, I should know. I'm pretty sure it is. Yeah, it is easy. <laughs> I totally should know because organization is like one of the main things of this channel. Um, so I'll probably be revisiting Marie Kondo's book. It's like a really quick read. I'll probably just read it again. Um, donate a lot of stuff, organize all this stuff, kind of try to keep anything that I keep at my parents' house in like one to two boxes. Um, Cause I do like minimal stuff, but I also have like a lot of instruments that I really like um and my sister's like and like i, I want to give to my kids one day maybe that i never play and i won't have room for in new york um a lot of stuff that i won't have room for in new york maybe even a pc but uh we'll see um so jobs organize and then also i do want to like i don't know um celebrate because I'll finally be able to celebrate my first graduation, um, which I did like, I got like valedictorian and like um, high honors and stuff, but I still didn't even, I mean, obviously getting your degree in the first place is, you know, a, an achievement, but I never really felt like, you know, I, I could celebrate it because of COVID. Um, so now I finally, I feel like I'm getting the chance to do that this, this uh, month. Um, and I probably should have spread these out a little bit more, um, but let me think, what can I do with this white space here? Mm -mm -mm. Let me see. I might just kind of like do a brain dump a little bit. Um, 2021. And this month marks the start of it. I want to begin feeling great and organized <laughs> so that our new life will be amazing and ugly stars i don't know i kind of like how that turned out and I do apologize. Um, I did I did have to make a cut because my battery just died. Again, I gotta get new batteries, but.
adding more green around there. I think it looks good. Um, so, I mean, really, I do have to, you know, fill out some <laughs> missing day pages, but I think I'm gonna do that kind of on my own time, um, do some reflections on my own time, uh, maybe update you next month and the next month's plan with me. Um, so yeah, I think that'll be it for this video. Um, I will be trying, <laughs> trying my best to upload weekly. Um, so if you have any ideas or if there's anything you wanna see, please do put that in the comments. Um, I do, you know, kind of need to keep to Hobonichi related material, but I do like to branch out kind of to wellness, organization, all of that, but um, kind of using this book as a basis for it because when you do, I like, I find that it works. It works a lot better. Um, or rather, it actually does end up happening. Um, so thank you for watching, especially if you're watching up until now. Um, all of my links are in the description. I have a Facebook group, which I will be definitely more frequent on, um, where I share, I think it has like a hundred people now. So I really do want to get active sharing, you know, tactics that we use, what our Hobonichi spreads look like. Uh, so if you're interested in joining that, um, please do click the link below. Um, also please subscribe. If you are interested in more written material, check out my blog. Um, everything will be in the description. And I will see you in a week, hopefully. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching.